Man, these bees, they sure aggravate you, baby. And I can't stand it in the spring. You, I, I love nature as good as anybody. Wouldn't bother them for the world. And when they eat your house up, you, year after year, it costs you big money. So you want to stop it. Well, you come to the right place. Now these little insects, they can flat eat some wood. They don't really eat it, they just bore holes in it and make nests. That's the problem with them, year after year. Now people think they're bumblebees, but here's a bumblebee. See how it's yellow in the front, yellow in the back? That's a bumblebee. Here's a carpenter bee. Now, it's mostly yellow in the front end of it. There's a big difference. Now bumblebee will sting, and these carpenter bees, they just try to scare you. And buddy, when these dozens of them flying you around your home year after year, they can really do some damage. Now you can sit here and swat at them all you want to. It's kind of fun. Uh, and I'd even really good practice with a BB gun if they'll just hold still long enough. But who's got time for that all day? See, here's some bee traps. Everybody says, oh, these bee traps don't work. They're just a waste of time. No, they're not a waste of time. I thought that too till I used them. I've had them up now for years. Put them up in the spring, take them down in the fall. Put them up in the spring, take them down in the fall. They keep these bees from eating your house up. It's about 99% effective. The trick is, you've got to stop up all the holes to where they don't go back to the old holes. And when they see these new holes, they don't have to work for it. They're kind of lazy anyway. It's just nature. So they'll go to these holes and check them out. And when they do, they get trapped. People say, well, what makes these so effective? I mean, why do they work? Well, right here's a print. I'll explain to you why they work. What they do, they've got a hole here around them, half inch hole, and it's at an angle. Okay, like the draw. And when they go in here for an easy hole for a nest, they don't like it. Well, the hole they came in on is at an angle, so it puts a shadow the light does. The only bright light left is coming from the bottom, this big one inch hole. So they just want to get out of there. So they come right down in this hole and they can't get out. They're trapped here. They can't fly back up and get out. So these are real effective. There's different styles here. These are more cosmetic style right here. And these right here is more economical. These don't cost you nothing. Just a bottle, I've already caught some bees in them. See here? I already caught some bees this year. You can just unscrew these, cap them, throw them away, screw your new cap on. Them right there are real thick. Real cost economical. These are more cosmetic if you like them. They're plastic. And the reason being plastic, yeah, you can use a mason jar or any kind of little old jar and screw in here. But the problem is, is when you do this up here trying to hang them. What happens to your glass? You got a mess. These won't do that. Especially you want to hang these around the eve of your house. They will work just fine. Now, if you want to know how to make these or you're interested in them, here I've got all kinds of videos, how to make them, the tools to hang them with, all kinds of little tricks and everything. Well, check these videos out. It really helped you out making anything. Now, it, it takes a little initial setup, but once you get them set up, it's nothing to take them down and put them up every year. And it's so cost effective, these things will last a lifetime if you take care of them. You might have to change the bottles. But here, this drawing hits for mostly just a little pot bottle, but you can put any kind of bottom on them over anything you want. Now, I have to say, since I put these up, I've caulked up all my holes, you know, before I put them up. But you can see that I've not had another hole drilled around the side of this house because these old bees, they'll check these holes out before they go to drilling one. Now, they will drill but they will, they, they'll, they'll check out these easy holes first and when they do, they're trapped. So I really appreciate you for watching and I'll see you next time.